again uh, I come here to explain another problem of finding dy by dx of uh, explicit function or equation right uh, now here we need to find out dy by dx of this equation x square y square equals to x square plus y square all right and every time I told you whenever you have to solve this concept problem first trick is differentiate both side left hand side as well as the right hand side with respect to x and in next time take all the places I mean find out all the places where right in, in those terms we have dy over the dx and once you got all the dy over the dx in one side then take the common dy over the dx and send everything to the other side and that will be your derivative that's it so two methods only it means two steps only right main two steps are there first we need to write the equation and differentiate I mean and, and we have to differentiate both sides with respect to x so the same thing I'm going to do here my equation is actually here x square y square equals to x square plus y square so let me differentiate both sides with respect to x right so differentiating both sides we get now derivative of x square dot y square with respect to x and this side also derivative of x square plus y square with respect to x and now in next step here uh, here is the problem a little uh, complicated it is see this is x and here is also x no problem but here is y square so you know x square will work as one function and y square will work as another function so we'll be first uh, uh, apply here a product rule all right so we'll be using product rule here and we'll try to solve up the derivative of this all right so let's let's use a derivative let, let me suppose this is my first function and this is my second function so derivative uh, when one function multiply another function we have like write first function and then derivative of the second function all right and again second function you have to write and find out the derivative of the first function all right we used here product rule and here if you come yes so it's like a you know a one first term and second term so try to use your sum rule so derivative of x square with respect to x and again derivative of y square with respect to x now let's come to the another point now see this is x square right this is x square we don't have any problem till now but problem is now going to create a little but that, that's not the problem actually see here is x but here is y so in this case what do we used to do yes again the same you guys are genius dy square over dy because we need to differentiate with the same thing you know that that, that should match so y is y square should be uh, differentiated with the y only and since y is a different thing a different function than the x so that's why we need to differentiate that y also with respect to the x and now this part we have finished already so let's let's talk about this part so it is already y square and this is dx square over dx since uh, x and x are going to match here so it is simply 2x and now let's come to the right hand side if you see in the right hand side x and x is matching so no problem it is 2x it is 2 all right and then now see again here y square and an x so it's not matching so what we have to do we have to differentiate dy square over dx uh, sorry over the dy because we need to differentiate y square with respect to y only and since y is different so we have to difference y also all right so in the next step we are going to have x square and derivative of y square with respect to y is actually 2y times dy over the dx and then plus 2xy square and this side you're going to get 2x and then plus this side you'll be getting uh, derivative of y square with respect to y is 2y times dy over the dx so let's go a little bit down and here you're going to have something like I already told you now after differentiation with respect to uh, x both side whenever you find out wherever you find out dy over the dx dy over the dx bring them into the one side only so I'm trying to just bring them into one side it is now 2y x square I'm just writing this part dy over the dx and this part I'm going to bring into the left hand side so all since this is positive and it will come right this positive will come this side as a negative all right I don't think I need to tell you this simple stuff now it is 2y dy over the dx is equal with now see this 2x is as it is here all right and I'm going to I'm going to 
shift this 2xy square also into the right hand side. So it will be minus 2xy square. All right. Now see here, your next next thing is here. You're going to have the common dy over the dx and dy over the dx. So let me first write dy over the dx as a common. And in the bracket, I'm taking these all things. This is 2yx square minus 2y. And in the another side, you have 2x you can take common. So 2x will come outside and it will be 1 minus y square. All right. No, no, no. Uh, uh, we are not going to divide right now. Next step, we'll be doing those things. So uh, dy over the dx, let me first write. So my dy over the dx, I write this side. And this is since multiplying this dy over the dx, so it will be dividing this side. So 2x, it is, you know, uh, uh, this is 1 minus y square. So if you want, then you can write something like this also. 1 minus y and 1 plus y. All right. And then whole divided by this whole quantity will be divided and this this is coming down here. All right. So it will be now uh, 2. See, here is 2y and here is also 2y. If you want, you can take the common also. 2y will be uh, coming outside and you'll be getting uh, x square minus 1. So here we are going to cancel out each other. 2 and 2. And by the way, there is no use of splitting this, right? So you can write 1 minus y square only, all right? This is no need to write. I was thinking there might get something uh, to cancel. So 1 minus y square, all right? So now your answer is x over y, uh, 1 minus y square over 1, x square minus 1, x square minus 1. So this is our derivative dy by dx. All right. So here, question was asking, what is the dy by dx? So we got dy by dx as x by y. You know, x one minus y square divided by y x square minus one. So this is our dy by dx of this function. All right. Uh, I hope you understand this problem. And if you have uh, some problem, then you can just uh, comment this below, or you can uh, send the message. I will try to solve if I will get the time. You know, because I get, uh, I mean, uh, really I get uh, less time. I need to do a lot of stuff. Anyways, uh, that's another thing. Mm. So we'll be now in the next video. We'll be doing a little bit different. You know, here we were uh, we were doing a kind of implicit problems. Uh, there. Like question will give you the already already question will tell you differentiate this function with respect to something and something will be different. All right, uh, that's the secret. <laughs> let's let's try to see in another video. We'll be meeting in the next video. Goodbye.